Hi, and welcome back to a very creepy Finders Beepers history series. I didn't know you started. <laughs> <laughs> this house, from what I've just seen in like two rooms, is one of the creepiest, weirdest feeling houses I have ever old, been in. It? It's really old. There's stuff coming out of the ceilings. I think it might have been partly a shop at some point yeah, as well. It looks like it. From the front, it looked, that's definitely what it looked like. But it's there's yeah. ivy and all sorts growing. Dog is going mental. I don't know he, when because we forgot. Oh, he's gone upstairs. Yeah, he's gone upstairs. We forgot a battery out of one of his torches and Andy had to go back and he was with me and he just went so quiet and Bear's not, he's bombing about now. He just didn't move, staring up at the ceiling. I'll put the clip in now, so weird. Bear, what are you looking at? Is there somebody here? Bear? What is it up there? What have you seen? Why do you keep looking up there? You're freaking me about out of it, Bear. I'm not gonna lie. You never like this. Why are you just sat there so quietly, not moving? What is up there? This is freaking me out, I'm not gonna lie. He's never like this. He's so quiet. Anyway, let's get looking round and see what we can find. <laughs> what are you laughing at? You with your paws. Yeah, because I'm... I'm not <laughs> no, it's because I need to put that bit in for bear. Anyway, anyway. It's got to spoil that one completely. It's, it's on. supposed to be organic and nice and all. Organic? Yeah, like organic. Anyway, let's get looking round. My head looks massive and grey. That's better. Mine just looks small and round. What is he doing? God knows. Right, let's get looking. Right, I was just going to show you in this room, but I don't know if you can hear Bear upstairs. He's just running up and down. Let me see if I can show you. I'm trying not to shine the torch up there. This torch is going crazy. Don't know what he's doing. I don't know if there's rats or something. He's chasing something. He's a rag route for a change, isn't I, he? I need to get over onto Bear's channel and watch what he's uh, been up to. <laughs> anyway, look at that old, is it? I don't even know if it's a singer. It's old. It looks like a singer because of the design on the side. What the hell are you doing, Bear? What have you been doing? I know, crazy dog. I don't know what's wrong with him. I think it is a singer because you know the bits around the edges there, like the Greek looking yeah. thing. That reminds me of singer. So I don't know, but it's very old and very weathered. Just like this telly. Got the old telly as well. With the back bit on top of it. Yeah. And the old Belfast sink. Now I have seen these, a couple of these about. Pick that up. You'll be shocked at how heavy that is. <laughs> It's ridiculous, isn't it? Put it tape. Yeah, it's um, is this some like stitching steel? See what it says? Rust resistant. Turn it round. Yeah, best mild steel stitching wire. Rust resisting. I don't know. Like, I know he, when you're making booklets, you know, like stitched booklets. Yeah. You don't put um, staples in them. People always think they're staple, but they're not. It's wire that runs through them. I only know that because of working for a print company. But that's what it reminds me of. But it seems too thick and too heavy for that. So I yeah, don't know. Thick, yeah, I don't know what that would be. 
What is he doing? He's on the right rubbish. Come on, before you lose that torch again. Come on, back in. Good boy. Right, let's get looking round. What's in there? Nothing. Oh, just some more of that wire stuff. Nothing up there as well. Oh, right, let's keep looking. What is happening here? There's feathers everywhere. What is that, a candle? Yeah, it's like a Guinness candle, yeah. isn't it? Bear, what are you doing? Shall we go and look up here? I don't think... Did he go upstairs or did he just go under there? Has he come... Oh, he's... <laughs> he's just in the cupboard. He is, he's definitely... I tried, tried to tie wrap it on today. Right. God knows. Oh, it looks like there's some good stuff in there. Yes. Right, let's go and look up here. Oh, quick, quick peruse. Because as far as I'm aware, there's not a great deal upstairs in these build this building. Mm. Oh, look. There's loads of that wire stuff there. Absolutely loads of it. I don't know what it would have been used for. And what looks like feathers from a quilt or a pillar or something. Loads of them. Oh, this looks a bit shaky, these steps, doesn't it? Just keep to the left. Why left? Because it's not attacked on the right. Oh, right, fair enough. How did you even get up here, Bear? You're going to show me? Go on, then. <laughs> not so bad when you get like, halfway up. He doesn't care, Bear, though. I don't mean he's not a care bear. <laughs> oh. Oh, Lord. Right, I'm coming. Right. Made it to the top of the stairs without dying. But look at these old ladders. I like them. They look like early 1900s, I think. You know, like 1920s, 1930s? Yeah, they're from 50s. Then. Shut up, they're not 50s. No, they're not 50s at all. But it, look at this wallpaper. This wallpaper's creepy. Don't know why wallpaper is creepy, but you know what I mean. The floor's creepy. <laughs> it goes, it bows like that, it metal. No, but you know when you like, think of a, like a horror film. Yeah. And you can imagine this wallpaper being on there and it all being a bit 1960s, 70s feel to it. We've just been saying Bear is only a small dog, but he's the heaviest walker in the world. Heavy isn't footed, isn't he? Yeah. Oh yeah. See, what was Bear making all the noise? Of? Oh my God, that's been held up by a stick. That ceiling's been held up by a stick. <gasps> what was that noise? Me, how are you? Right, Bear, what's wrong with you? Why are you panicking so much? Yeah, exactly, that whole wall's falling away. Uh, I don't trust that one stick. <sighs> Freaking me out, man. Oh, it's a bit creepy in here, Andy. I think there's somebody's ashes in here, Andy. I don't know if it is ashes, but that's what it reminds me of. Oh, no, it's not. <laughs> it's licorice. Slight <laughs> difference. Yeah. Look, that's what I thought it was. Bluebird licorice toffee rolls. That's all good, isn't it? Look at that. I wonder if that came out of that window originally, then. I don't like this floor. The floor's, the floor's not bothering me at all. Oh, is that as far as it goes? No, back on the circle. Oh, okay. Oh, we're back at the top of the stairs yeah. next to that ladder. Next to the ladders. Right, we've made Bear go downstairs. One, so he can go and have a look round and not just follow us round. But two, because he's so noisy. And you know what? As soon as he's gone, he's so quiet. Go and sit in the little main road. There's houses across the road. Yeah, we're very quiet, isn't it? We literally bang across from people's houses. And it is. It's spooky though. It's got a really odd feel. Apart from him downstairs, just legging it up and down like a madman. But it's just, I don't know, look at the, like the roof made out of sticks and stuff as well. It's not wattle and daub. No. But I can't remember what it's called when it's when it's like reeds. It's like reeds, it's not isn't it? outside, is it? I don't think so. We'll have to have a look outside because it looks creepy. The yeah. whole building looks creepy from the outside as well. But let's have a look at... What, oh, is, what is he doing? 
I don't think you can get up off the first two steps again. He's struggling. <laughs> He's an idiot. I thought, just open this. Let's have a look at the fireplace. Is it an old Victorian fireplace? Look at the old bucket thing as well. Ah, oh, it is. It's not very detailed, but I still like it. What's the sacking in it? Why did they do that? Is it just Stop a block? Crafts. Oh, yeah. If they weren't using it anymore. And before they boarded that up, probably just packed it. Yeah. No, that does make sense. But why would they do that? Because no eating. You'd think you'd still use it, wouldn't you? Yeah. Don't know, because it's only single pane as well, isn't it? It's not double glazed or anything. No. So, but I do, I do like, there's something about that toffee thing and this that I really like. Anyway, let's uh, make our way back through. What, did we miss anything? I feel like I rushed through here. I don't think we did, I think we just... What's, when's that newspaper from? Oh, See, you you miss things all the time, you. Let's have a look. Eastley Daily Press, 1968. That one's from. What's what's it talking about? Government aims to make 18 the voting age. Why? What was it before? 21? I don't know. It must have been. Must have been older than 18. It wouldn't have been younger, would it? Unit has 27 births before opening. What? How can it have 27 births before it's actually even open? God knows. That makes no sense. Shook hands after stabbing, court told. So he stabbed him and shook his hands. So thank you very much. <laughs> Oh my god, that's ridiculous. But yeah, this. Look at look at the cobwebs in here. Look at these. They're thick. You can see there's not been many people come through these doors for a while. Look at that. But that worries me. Because look at the big crack in that wood there. Oh, we're gonna have you going. Keep walking. Oh, oh cobwebs. Is it, you notice them more because you've got no air, do you yeah, think? Yeah, I feel, I feel it. When you, yeah. it touches your head, you can't feel it. Yeah. But I just feel it on my skin. I think that's probably it, because I don't really, I do, when I notice them, they're all over me. Yeah. But unless that happens, then I, I don't really feel them. These floors are so shaky, aren't they? I didn't realise. That'll be straight down as well, because it's just reeds, in it? Underneath there. So you Is put it? your foot, yeah, you can see the reeds log there. So if you put your foot on that, it'd go straight through, I'm sure it would. Don't break oh, it. It's all off. Yeah, but it's got like this plaster on the other side of it as well. But I think if you put any weight on that, it's gone. Yeah. So, right. I want to have a stick my head up in this attic as well. I'm interested what's up there. Oh, this one. What's this from? What's that? I'm confused by this room because there's a sink in it. But it's clearly a, a kid's bedroom or something. Or is it a kid's bathroom? But what's that? It looks like a telly went in it. And now it's just full of spiders. It's a kitchen unit, but it's on its end. Oh, oh yeah. It should be that way. I wonder if they've just shoved it up here once the kids have moved out or something. Yeah, just moved it from downstairs. And put a new kitchen in at some point. There's no taps on it, like. there's no water in it. Oh yeah, but why would you save it? God knows. It doesn't make sense, does it? People used to save stuff years ago, didn't they? Just well, yes. Yeah. Yeah, true. I'm a little bit of that mentality sometimes. Yeah. I can be a bit of a hoarder, I'm not going to lie. Look at all these electric wires just cut. Oh, is it a... Coin operator. Coin meter. Wow. Don't is see it 50 pounds? I don't know. Oh, florins. Florins only. Florins? Yeah. When are florins from? Pre Pre-decimalisation. So is that 70s? 71, isn't it? Something like that, yeah. So, yeah. That, that meat has been there since the 70s, that's mad. You would have thought it would have been changed over. Right, let me have a look. I wonder if this has been empty since then. Maybe. It looks like it has, to be fair. If you think about that in there, that looks like 80s. You know that toffee thing? Yeah. That doesn't look like 90s or 2000s. Same. Oh, when I was saying that, they took the wires out and cut it off, but that don't know weird. So unless mm. there's a new palace oh, there could downstairs. Be. Right, I'm going to have a look up there, but I am very, very wary. So I think I'm just going to stick my head up. I'm not actually going to climb up because look at the ceilings. I wouldn't. I don't want to come through. Right, let's see if this thing takes my weight. Right, this is this is ridiculous. Look at that. Torch. You want to my torch? <laughs> that torch is 1970s or 80s. I don't think that's a torch, me. What do you mean? Shut up, you rude man. Can you please hold this because it is wobbling like fuck and I'm on the edge of the stairs. I'm on the edge. Oh, God, don't. I don't. Does my head go through there? 
Because oh, it's big, but it's not that big. No, I didn't know if there were a wall. Oh, God. Well, there is warp boards. Just let me try and pull myself up a little bit more. Right. So there's pan tiles on top of here. So it's not a thatched roof, Andy. No. No, there's pan tiles, but then it's reeds underneath it as well. There is warp boards up there, but it only goes to an old stone, what looks like chimney. But then it looks like the chimney's been changed at some point. Oh, you can get through to the other side, I think, but I am not risking that. But... Well, there is warp boards, but the warp boards only look... The furthest ones away look a bit rotten. I don't know if it's worth it, worth the effort. I don't think I could pull myself up here anyway, because all the wood you have to grab onto is really, really thin. Yeah. I'll go and see if we can get in at the other side, to be fair. But yeah, there's a chimney that looks like it's brick, but it doesn't look like it was originally brick. It looks like it was stone. So I don't know how old this place is, but it's pretty old. <laughs> right, I'm coming back down. Oh yeah, there might be a day. I don't know if they can hear you, so I'm just repeating what you're saying. Right, I'm coming back down. Right, so there was stained glass through there, and there's some more here, look, leaded stained glass. That looks quite old as well. That's cool, that. But I can't work out where it's from. No, the window's not leaded. Just no. Well, the, that other bit's here, look. Can you shine your torch through this? Oh, I can't pick it up, it's gonna break. Gotta be really careful with it if you pick it up, Andy. What are we looking at before then? That. I think it's yellow and blue. Don't grab it by the top where I've just grabbed it. Don't grab it there. Get it at both sides, two hands. Because that is not gonna stay together if you don't. Right, wait. Look at that. That's beaut, actually, isn't it? Yeah. That'd look really nice in a window. But it's not out of there. 100% it's not out of there. No. So, but yeah, what I'm saying is, look, that's got to be 80s. 16 pence. Would you say 80s? Oh, it's full of water. 16 pence per quarter. That's what, four ounce? No, I don't know. Yeah, 16 pence per four ounce. Why, why is it a quarter? What's it's it? It's qu a quarter of a pound. Oh, is it quarter of, ah. I always wondered what quarters were. Yeah, quarter of a pound. Right, okay. Right, let's go back down. Water mix, please. Yeah, I know, I remember people saying it. I definitely remember people saying it back in the day. Yeah. But you didn't know what I never water knew meant. what it meant, no. Yeah. Oh, look, there's green glass there as well. I wonder if that's part of it. Because it's flat gla glass, isn't it? Can't speak, flat glass. I don't know where. Foie gras. Oh, talking about foie gras the other day. Do you know what foie gras is? Um, I think you've told me before. So what they used to do is get a goose, well they still do it, yeah. um, they'd stick a pipe down its throat and fill it with grain and then let it sit in its stomach like so it was so full, it literally like force feed it so much yeah. and then murder it and eat it. I, I don't know why I said murder it because... You're awesome, isn't it? I know, it sounded like a vegan for a second then, but you know what I mean, it is foie gras and what's the other one as well, veal is supposed to be quite... Not nice as well, innit? I suppose that's only like lamb. It's baby cow, innit? Not mine, veal. It's baby cow, though, innit? That's why people don't like it. Right. Just dog pooed his pants. Right, I'm coming down. Have you seen the floor, by the way? I love this floor. Tile floor. It's proper tiles as well. It's not like a laminate, you think. Not laminate. What do I mean? Lino. Lino. Yeah, you get a lot of lino floors, but this is a proper tiled old floor. I think this place has got some real age, you know. God, I'm hoping there's a date on the Yeah, I am. Plus, if it used to be an old shop, yeah. you'd think there'd be a date on it, wouldn't you? The doors are quite low, though, as well, have you noticed? Yeah, what? So, I, I just wonder if... Six foot? Yeah. Well, no, because I don't think I... Would my head touch it? I'm sorry. Yeah, just about. Mm. Like, six foot and a bit. Six foot, six and a, six foot and a half. Yeah. Get me air on it, but that's about it. Oh, wow. What are you looking at? What's that? Can I do, can you go in a bit? Because I'm stuck in a doorway. Oh, careful with it. It's a fascinator or something, isn't it, to go in your hair? Oh, it's like a proper 
Is it actually a wink? Nah, it's definitely something to go in your hair, surely yeah, that. Some sort of... Um, but it's just probably broken over years. There's another bit of it in there. For is there? Careful. Right, look at this. That's good, isn't it? Real to real. Yeah. How old was, would you say that is? 60s? 50s, 60s, gotta be. Yeah. That's good, that. Oh, I like it in here. Like, there's not... There's not loads of stuff in here, but what is in here is good. Like, things like this, stupid things. Huntley and Palmer's, the first name you think of in biscuits. This is what Vladimir Putin's gonna do soon. Oh. Russian compensation. Claim some compensation when I've won the war. <laughs> yeah, don't you think that's a... Ooh. See how close we are to the road, yeah. It's really good, that though. When's that from, that Russian compensation? Thing. 80s. 87, 1987. All right. Crash victims. What's that? When's that one from? 1988. I reckon it must be 80s then. Oh, when it's short. 80s or 90s, yeah, when it's short. It's gotta be. I need to sneeze. It's so dusty in here. It is. Really dusty. What is that jacket? Is that, is it a suit? Is that like a trouser suit? Or is that a skirt? skirt. It's a skirt. Oh, so it's like a skirt suit. What do you call it when it's not a trouser suit, it's a skirt suit? A skirt suit. You don't one. call it a skirt suit. What's he sniffing? What's that? What's under his feet? I don't know what he's sniffing, but what's under his feet? What's the metal thing? Peacock. Oh, I wonder what that wear. That's what he's looking at in there. It's so, so dusty there. Smallest shoes in the world. Oh, yeah. That's to fit me. <laughs> there it is. What do you mean virtually fit you? I know you're a size seven, but that, they must be a size three or two. Four. No. Look at, right, look at that. You're telling me that's only a four? That's got to be a two. That's tiny. Is that a four? Shut up, foot right. There's got to be a size on it. They're not a four. I would say looking tongue. <laughs> There's a size on bottom. They usually aren't base. There, look. Turn it. It's not a size. It's just some writing. Can't see what that says. I don't know what that says at all. Oh, that says some at soles. And Perry, no, there's no size on it. That is not a four. Hundred percent, that is not a four. You're so wrong. It's tiny, tiny. Four, oh, says it there. Look. Shut up. You're lying. I knew it. I knew you were lying. I don't know what it is. No, nah, I think about. I'm only a seven. Shut up. Look how wide it is, or not? It's almost like a child's shoe. I've got massive boots on them. I don't care. I've right. I'll take my shoe off. Look how small it is compared to my foot. Yeah, you're eleven. I'm not 11, I'm 10 and a half. All right, look. You big toe in, man. Exactly, look how thick, I can get three toes in it. Three, look, look at that. Camel toe in it. That's ridiculous. Absolutely no way that's a four. Never seen a four. I don't know why we're arguing over the size of a shoe. We've been for like the last five minutes. I think we've exhausted that. Yeah, yeah. Right, what we got on here? Oh, I don't like blended whiskey. I only oh, like shite. any blended whiskey is shite. It's got to be single malt. Definitely single malt. Hey, look, is this what, have you just put this down here? Yeah. Oh, I thought there were another one then. Oh, Andy. I think this is the highest we've ever seen. To someone who's extra special, 102. You actually got that right, Oh, look. Mary Hill with love. It's got loads of names in it. Lo oh, I reckon they're all old people as well because of the way that they've written them. I don't know if all of them are, but some of them are like Mrs. Tripp and Mr. and Mrs. Hazelwood. Oh, 102. That is, oh, 1990. So she was born in 1888. 1888. That's a, that is a year that always seems to pop up wherever we go, 1888. Loads of abandoned buildings are built then as well. But she, that abandoned Nanan, she were born then. Yeah. 
Um, my grandmother was born in 1898. Really? Yeah. My grandmother was born in 1918. Right, I don't know what I think about this fireplace. Like, that, I can't date it, can you? I looked at it and thought, oh, is it like 50s? But then I think, is it older than that? Yeah. I feel like it should be. And I don't know if this fire surround is original or not, but... No. I don't know. I can't quite work it out. But I do like it. And I do like it when they've got these. I know that's added on extra, isn't it? Yeah. But it's a nice one, look. I think it's made out of maybe brass or something. Just use your hands. I don't know. It looks... Is it wood? Or is it... Oh, no, it's not... Just tin. Oh, is it tin? Yeah. I know it got like a weird sort of patina to it. Like it was metal, but then I thought it might just be stained wood or something. Yeah. Oh, look at this. Like, there's loads of old newspapers on the floor, and some of these look old. Like, look at that. Yeah, that's 50s then, isn't it? Yeah. There's loads of them. Might have a look at some of these in a minute, but look at this. And look who's there. Oh, the man. Although, you see, loads of people love him. Winston Churchill, but... There's a lot of bad things being said about him as well, aren't there? So I don't know what I think about him now. Like, when I watched The Crown, I really liked him. But then when you hear about stuff that went off with, like, racism, sexism, things like that... Rife, weren't it? Yeah, it's just the time, I suppose. Yeah. And that class. He's banging about again. But, yeah, I don't know. Let's have a look. Wide, wide world... I don't think that's very old. Or oh, not very really good, anyway. When's this telly from? Decca Colour. When was Colour TVs? 80. I, I'm sure people said that it were well before or that. Or just before. I don't know. No, I'd I'd probably, I'd probably say late 70s. Right. I'm sure people are going to correct us on that, because I'm sure last time they said, oh, there were Colour TVs in 60s. Yeah. So, don't I don't know. I don't know. We got our first colour toy in 1979. Yeah, but when did they first bring in colour people? No, I mean, like, because oh, obviously, oh. no, like, in the war, they were all black and white. So, like, when did people start going, like, pink and, and brown oh, and... I don't know. It's, it's weird, isn't it? You just see his little torch and he just looks so weird. Like alien walking What's he doing, Lisa? Oh, I just love watching him sometimes. He just goes around, like, looking up at little things and... Oh! Is this... What are these? These look like, um... You know, the old pop bottles. Um, what's it called now? Lucasaid. Yeah. Like, Lucasaid bottles, those. Look at the sink in the corner in the cupboard. I've not noticed that. Look, you just... Shut your cupboard that when it does shut. Oh, when it did shut. Yeah. And then you've got a little weird corner sink with some Idris Indian tonic water, water and Canada dry ginger beer. Oh, that is proper retro in here, isn't it? Oh, my Lord, look at the old style cans. Can't work out what that is. It's not Coke, is it? No, don't think so. Just turn it back around the other way. There's right in there. Well, it could be Coca-Cola. Yeah, it is. It's an old Coca-Cola. Can I look at the top of it? Look. I don't know how they drank that, to be fair. They must have put it in a glass. I don't think they had best before dates and stuff on them then, though, did they? I don't know what that is. No idea about that one. Do you know what I want to find? I don't know if they still do it. Do you remember Cremola foam? No. I think it's a Scottish thing, and I think I only remember it from when I was in Scotland when I was little. But creamola foam, it was like sherbet in a in a pot, and you spooned it in and then put water in with it, and it went fizzy. No. And it was so nice, and I, I haven't seen it since I was a kid, but I only remember it in Scotland, so I wonder if it was a Scottish yeah, thing. Scottish thing. Oh. Weird right, it, it was so nice. Honestly, Scotland produces so much good food. It's unbelievable. Haggis. Haggis is about the best thing that comes out. Haggis is beautiful. Uh, macaroni pies. You can't beat a good macaroni pie. 
deep fried wherever it is. Yeah, not everything's deep fried up there. A lot of it's deep fried up there, to be fair. But yeah, no, if you remember Cremola foam, tell me, because I loved it. What's that there? Oh, Elastoplast. That's some sort of cherry, oh no, it's tomato juice. Do people still drink tomato juice? You used to yeah. see it a lot, didn't you though? And he had it in Bloody Marys, Bloody Marys and stuff. Oh, what's this? What's that one? It's upside down. Turn it right way around. Cream table. Cream label. Stout. Oh, it's stout, that one. Look at the little clock. See, I love it when you get these windows like this. You get like old plants growing through. Don't say it, because I know that it's in your head, but don't say the thing that explorers always say when there's plants coming through windows, because it winds me. It's another one of the things that winds me up. You're going to say it, aren't you? No, I'm not. Good. What's this? Is, is that nature taking over? I'm good. That's not what they say. <laughs> nature taking back. I hate it. I absolutely hate it when people say that. Oh, it's nature taking back. Has that ever been opened? It's never been opened, huh? Where's the drink gone? It's like that same, isn't it? Oh, there's an hole inside there, look. Oh, it's all just rusted. Yeah, rusted and then just leaked. Rats have been supping it. Yeah, definitely. Oh, look. There's just, I don't know why, there's just little things like trays and tins and stuff like that. And stuff that Andy's going to smash because he's got no eyes. Oh, rolling pins. I don't know, it just makes me think of like an old, proper, old-fashioned house where they made everything and they went to the shop at Christmas and got the big tin of biscuits. Yeah. It, that sort of thing. It just makes me think of proper, good, old-fashioned England. Old-fashioned 60s, 70s family yeah or maybe yeah no yeah 60s 70s is probably about right to be fair i've walked straight past this i didn't even notice this at all what, radio gaga yeah it's good that is there anything in these cupboards no oh the old wallpapers under there though but there's some more of these oh bronco brands bengal matches all the old brands of stuff it's so good i love it in here some of that over there isn't it? yeah there's all this room <laughs> and you have to like shove that light up my ass. <laughs> don't say you're not loving it because you are. I know that sun shines out my ass but I don't want to light up my ass. <laughs> oh what's this? What What's good boy chocolate drops? Is it for dogs? Oh it's for dogs yeah. And little flowers and stuff. A little mirrored unit. What's that one? Oh sure. is it Schler? I love Schler. Really old. That is a real. I didn't know they did it back then, to be fair. Oh. Why did people display things like cups? I think somebody just put them on. Like no, that. I think people did do that. And look, like tatty. Flowers, yeah. Crappy flowers and stuff. Well, that, yeah. But. Yeah, right, let's keep going through. Right. Oh my lord, look at it in here. Worse for wear in here, isn't it? Just a little bit. Oh, is that a piano? Is this a piano? I'm looking up there. <laughs> this is a piano, like, what? I can't actually get in to have a look because as usual, you stand right in the middle so I can't get past. Yeah, it is a piano, look. Oh, it's a right old plinkety plonkety one as well. Look, look at all the bits. These are all gone. I know. Oh no, they aren't, they're under here. They're under here, look. They're, they're weird ones as well. They're not. White, as white, they just would. Do you reckon, oh look, what is that you freak? That looks like a big airy vagina on a stick. <laughs> right, but the, the, it did have whiteness on it, look. Cause that's the top of a white key there, look. Would they be made of, what would they be made of, ivory? It wouldn't be ivory. Be, I think originally the Mac. Well, I think the, it's ebony and ivory, isn't it? Yeah, I know. But surely, when did that stop? That's like a doctor's bag, isn't it? It's an old handbag. Is it, that's not a handbag, is it? Too yeah. Weird handbag. What's the, um, what's the? Like music. Oh, brilliant waltzers. Wal waltzers. waltzers. Is it, why do I want to say waltzers? Is that what you go spinning around on in yeah. a fairground? Yeah. Why do they? Did they, were they named, oh, I've never thought about well, that. Hey, oh! No, no were, they, were they named after um, waltz, waltzers? Waltzers, because they spin round, and in a, when you dance in a waltz, you spin yeah, round. probably. Is that where the names come? I've never yeah. thought about that. 
That is so strange. What's he doing now? No idea. He's just a, an idiot. He's having a good time, whatever. He is. What we got up here? Oh, Robinsons. Every Robinsons used to be all over everything. That you know the orange barley water, disgusting yes. stuff. That's crunchy. Orange juice is always crunchy. Dilute orange. Do you know what I mean? You're just ignoring me, aren't you? Malacolic cordial. Oh, cordial will be malacolic. Fest right? Festival. I mean, yeah, like festive. Yeah, just fucking turn round and talk to me instead of ignoring me. It's only because you drink orange juice and now you've got face on because I'm knocking orange juice. No, do you know what I mean, though? When you have orange juice and it's crunchy. No. You don't know what, why? Because never had crunchy orange juice, there's something wrong with it. It's gone off. No, in it's just like, I think it's because you put like a spitz worth of it in it. And I put a lot more in. You put in. like this much in? Yeah, that's how much you're supposed is to have in. Is it tough, your bell end? No, it's crunchy. Vimto's not crunchy. Orange juice is. And it also makes me cough, orange juice. Is it? Yeah, you know, like dilute orange juice. But a lot well, of people... That's because you're wrong. No, a lot of people with asthma can't have dilute orange juice. Why? Because it brings asthma attacks on. Does it? I don't know why, but well, I wonder if... You made that up? No, honestly, I know people that can't have it, but... Oh, tell me. I'll I can't think it. off the top of my head, but I know I know it's true. But I wonder if it's because I've got A fever that oh, makes okay. me cough. I don't know, it's weird. Because did you know, I just feel like I'm talking and rambling and rambling. Yeah. But you know, um, melon make yeah. my ears itch. If I eat melon, it makes my ears itch. And there's something to be mashed potato. Yeah, that makes... I have to squint my eyes uh -huh. when I eat mashed potato. So it's you. You're just a weirdo. <laughs> no. Nobody else no. ever, no. ever does that when they eat mashed potato. Right, if anybody maybe, does that, yeah. <laughs> Maybe the mashed potato, I'll give you that, because I don't know anybody else that does it. And but melon makes your ears no, itch. No, melon is linked yeah. to... Um, and tomatoes as well. Tomatoes make me top of my mouth itch and me ears itch. It's linked to hay fever. Look it up. Bet I'm right. Right. Oh, have you seen the ceiling in here? That is that is gone. That is. Is that an old lean to? No, I don't know what it is. Oh, there's a fireplace in here. Look. Oh God, this is all a bit a bit ropey. Yeah, look at that big. Like, that's a good fireplace as well. That. I don't think it's that old though. But I like it. Oh, it's all a bit spooky in this bit. Oh. Oh, wallpaper's a bit exotic. Look at that beam, Andy. I know. That is a that is a damaged beam. I'm gonna. There's a door up there. It's all a bit a bit Why scary. Out of the way? I could do, but I'm here now. It's hard to get that way anyway. It's harder to get that way through the jungle that's down here. Look. I feel like you've come in harder way. See, that was really hard. Oh, just watch out, because that's another big beam there that's gone. Oh, this is all very bizarre. Is that all it is? There's another door at the back, though. God, it's just massive. Hey, I wonder if these bits of glass are off. It is a lean-to. That's the outside of the house there. Yeah. Oh, careful, Andy. Oh, which way are you go? Make your mind up. Couldn't turn around properly. All right, let's have a look. Oh God, this is this is a tight squeeze. Oh, I don't want to go into a toilet. Might get. Oh, oh, oh! That door just broke, and all the stuff shot up my balls. Oh yeah. I don't really want to go into any more toilets because no. I feel like there's blokes just going to appear and start stealing stuff and. Grabbing us, so. Grab him, grab him. <laughs> oh, but I want to have a look in here, but I don't even understand what's going off in there. There's tables, but then there's roof, but then just a wall. There was a roof. Yeah, there's no roof anymore. I see if there's a bit. Oh, Dulux. Yeah, loads of paint. It was like I wonder if it was like a an outdoor. I don't know. What would he use this room for with a big fire like that? God knows. Because I thought they were archways there. Yeah, I thought they were like ovens, but they're not. No. Oh, this is so awkward. Look at it. Look up there, though. It's 
just properly fallen down, hasn't it? Yeah. But it was well made by the looks of things. Well, obviously not that well it's a made. Shame that we put it on the end because that that is it's a it's got to be a couple of hundred years old. This house, look at the state of it. I know, definitely. Looking at that wall and the how it's set up, even with the pan tiles. Pan tiles you don't generally get on houses anyway these days, do you? Unless they're very expensive new houses. Yeah. But yeah, right. I'm gonna head back where the, the way I came. You can go back the way you came. Right some more room through that side that's where we've just come from we'll go upstairs now it's weird this look because that door why is there a door at the bottom of the stairs there's always a door i don't know do you you have a door no. into your hallway i haven't got a hallway you a hallway oh yours is just what do you mean mine's a 1901 terraced house that's... there's no doors on the it inside got doors uh, to be fair, there's a door at the bottom of the two doors at the bottom of my stairs. Hold on. One at each side. <laughs> Is that? Yeah. So like you walk through from the living room to the dining room and there's the stairs in between yeah. and there's two doors. I never noticed. Well you wouldn't do, you've only been there once. I'm not like, pissed. Yeah, we're absolutely bladdered. Yeah, so, <laughs> so why would you? But there's another door here. Which bears in there somewhere. You can hear him rattling round. God knows. Oh Andy. Bit freaky up here. Oh, what is that? Look at that old coat. Is it a, it's a dress? Is it a dress? Yeah. I thought it was like an apron. Yeah, like a pinny. Oh, that door opens weird. By oh, foot. What is in there? Oh. What's that? Cal Chichu D3. Calcium oh, is it? Yeah. yeah. I like that. That lid. This. Oh, yeah. If it got the rest of it with it, that'd be quite nice, that. I quite like that. What's the book? The Bible. It's going to break. You're so heavy handed, you. Oh, no. Something about songs. Can you just do something else with it instead of just holding it like that? Well, if I do, you say. Stop moving it! Move it up, move it to the left! Move it to the right! Turn it upside down! Yeah, they know because it is the wrong way up. Christmas. Christmas. To, oh, yeah, it's, is it hymns? Looks like hymns. Yeah. Preface. Yeah. Right, let's get up these creepy stairs. That was a spooky... Yeah, it's weird up here, isn't it? Spooky shot, that. Yeah. I don't like it, Andy, I don't like it up here. It's all a bit weird. Oh, God, how low is it? It's ridiculous, isn't it? <laughs> I'm proper, like, I can't stand up, nowhere near standing up. <laughs> Get on that top step and you'll see what I mean. <laughs> I can't restrain my legs out. I don't, I'm like that. Hello? I just think it's, it's just dirt. You know what, it might be a fire. It smells burnt. Burnt. It smells burnt. Yeah. I can never work out your accent. Oh yeah, 102 cardigan up here. I don't mean a cardigan. She ain't got an 102 yeah, year old cardigan. cardigan. <laughs> That'd be well worn, that would it? That would be well made if it's 102 year old. Oh, what's the cup for? Drinking out. Can you get it? Why are you so scared of floors you, recently, you? Is there any writing on it or anything? It's got to be a, a cup for... It's not like a cup for virgin's blood. It's got to be like... The Holy Grail. We've actually found it. <laughs> You're an idiot. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like... Don't break it, Mr. Do. Heavy-handed. No, is it for like... Or is it present presentation-y type thing, do you think? I've got no idea. If it is, it's a shit. What's that, be somebody's ashes? Oh, don't. And then the little clock. Oh, there's another. That, what's that? Is that for flowers? What's that? For ashes from cricket. <laughs> it does look like the ashes as in the cricket, doesn't it? Oh, is it flat roof out there? 
Don't mention Ashes when we pick up the Australians. They'll be all piping up soon, won't they? I don't care. Mm -hmm. They can win it as many times as they want for me. I don't give two hoops. Yeah. I don't care about cricket, it's um, the worst, most boring game in the world. I know, um, it just makes me laugh. Oh, he's got 40 runs, he's been in there eight hours. I don't I can run a marathon in eight hours. I don't understand it. I don't get it. And I, I don't like cricket anyway because I got hit balls with a bloody corky at full speed once. I got it there. Yeah. I had the biggest bruise. I were down for an hour. I was like hardest kid in school and it... Proper made me cry. I cried my eyes out. It really hurt. Nothing's ever hurt like that before. So I got, I got there, 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 yeah, one of them. Yeah. <laughs> hit there by a teacher, bowled it as well. Oh, I thought you said you got hit there by a teacher, as yeah. in like he went and punched uh, you in your balls. I went like that and, I, and I stood back like that to hit it and it hit me right there. Really? I, I was like, fucking, it made my balls tingle and everything. Right bruise. Oh, God. We're awful. Yeah, no, it is, oh, it is really bad. Crap of battle, anyway. Do you reckon there were a fireplace there? Yeah. There was something there, weren't there? Oh, look. You've got coat all the hooks. coat hooks there, yeah. It's just, it's so creepy in here. It's, it's one of the weirdest feeling rooms I've ever been in. And even though there's nothing in here, I just, I, I'm almost drawn to this room. I like it, but in a weird, freaky kind of way. I feel like I could stay here. So it's a bit of calling out. Done. That would be weird. Well, if we could, if that if that moved, sit on that chair. No. Shut the door. No. Shut, you, think you are Larry Grayson. Shut the door and leave me in here. Andy, shut the door and leave me in here. I want to stay in here for a minute. I'll take your torch off you and then I, shut the door. I like it in here. There's something about it. I don't know why. Just feel very much at home in here. There's weird noises outside that I think are you'd bear. It's so strange. I feel really comfortable. Fuck knows, but it's really, really weird in here and I like it. Right, let's go. Right. I had a feeling these upstairs rooms were all going to be like this, but there's always one, just like one old so chair. chair. Yeah. The freaky curtains. I told you this, this place is just very strange. Now, I know I've just... Made a big, loud, screamy, shouty noise. But I genuinely, I wasn't just doing it for effect. I felt so comfortable in that room. I just wanted to stay. I didn't want to leave that room. I just want to stay in there. Fine by me. Well, you're driving as well, aren't you? Yeah. I wonder how comfortable this is. I feel like it's got air all over it. It's filled with horse air. Oh, yeah, I suppose so. Is it comfy? It's actually not that bad. Is it? No, I, 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 feel, I can feel the ridge of the wood round the edge, but... The ridge of either around the edge. Shut up. You're a disgusting man. Look at this ceiling as well. It's proper bowing. I like how they made a... Oh, rounded. Yeah, instead of squared it off. Yeah. They could have easily just made that square. Yeah, I wonder why. There must be a reason for that. There's definitely got to be a reason for it. Now, this is the other side of that attic bit that I was in a minute ago. And I, I can't even get up enough to show you. But it's going to be exactly the same, isn't it? It'll just be empty. Because I've noticed there's a big, there's a sealed up bit up here. Another entrance there, look. So I thought it might be worth climbing through, but I really don't think it will be. And be in there. Solitary chair. Oh, oh, not quite the same though, is it? Look at this room. I don't know why, they're just weird. What's up with you? You just walk straight through that cobweb and drag it all the way in there with you. Oh, is it all over? This is what I'm saying, I don't even realise I'm doing it half the time. Unless it goes in your face, and that's the worst feeling in the world, isn't it? Cobwebs across your face is You're awful. Cobwebs. You're disgusting. But yeah, look at it all coming through the windows and everything. What a freaky place. 
That's a really is low it, ceiling. Isn't it? Is it bad that I want to go back in that room? Yeah, because you're weird. Can I just go back in for a minute? Yeah. I'm going to walk downstairs. Okay. I'll come and meet you in a minute. I want to stay in here. I want to be quiet. I don't know why. I don't know what you're doing out there, but you're making some weird little noises. What are you doing? Andrew, can you stop please? What are you? <laughs> You're a weird person sometimes. Yeah. Just, just come in here with me a minute. Why, why do I like in here so much? Just come in. Just shut the door. Is that a record, please. Oh yeah, it is. Yeah, just come in. Shut the door. And just be quiet a minute. No, I'm not. All the neighbours are going to come. No, out. I'm not. But doesn't it feel weird and peaceful? Feels warm, isn't it? Yeah, warm, comfortable, peaceful. Just want to. I honestly, if there were like a little bed, I would want to get in it. I don't know why. I've never felt like this. I, I feel on edge in little rooms. I'm not screaming. I'm not doing anything. Waiting for it. No, I'm not. I promise you. But normally, it's a case of wanting to. Like, get out of a room if it feels uncomfortable, or like a room like this, there's no reason for me to want to be in here, but I just feel so at peace and so comfortable in here. It's lovely. I would honestly, if I would stay in here for a while, I'm not going to do anything, I promise you. You're, you're, you're just building this up too much. <laughs> no, I mean it. I promise you. I'm telling you. There's no. Come on, we can go if you want now. There's nothing. Oh, dear. Oh, God. I'm only stepping towards you. What are you doing? Well, I mean, I was See, going. you don't trust me. Your eyes are watering as well. You're weird. Oh. I just like it in there. I've never wanted to be in a room as much as that in my life. I never <laughs> come out here and I don't... I come back out here and I feel absolutely fine. I'm just so drawn to that room. It's so weird. Right, let's go back down. Right, Bear's just come back without his camera. At oh, all. It's out there somewhere. Oh, is it? Can you see the light from it? Yeah. But I'll tell you something. I don't, I don't fancy being out there for it. We're going to have to. One of us. And I think it probably should be you because you're thinner. I have to take your bag off though if you are. I might just get out of the way. All right, let's go and have a look. What are you doing? I wonder if you got stuck on something. All right, I'll let them go and have a look. I want to go back up to that room. I better not. I can hear him. Oh, there's umbrellas up here. You got it? There, look behind there. Is it all attached? Yeah. How has he managed that? God knows. That's really strange. There's an old drawer there, look. An old drawer. Like a jacket. I wonder what this room was used for before. It's quite awkward to show you because there's stuff in my way. Right, let's go back round to Andy. Let's put it back on him then. Right, managed to get it back on him. Battery's almost dead on camera though. He's not got much life left on it. Need to stop bringing some spare batteries with me to be fair. But, right. We've not been around this way, have we? No. Yeah. cut beetroot. Ugh, imagine. I don't like beetroot anyway. Oh, here we go. Are you going to make fun of me as well? Or is it just Rachel when I say beetroot? Beetroot. You say beetroot. Yeah, not beetroot. Yeah, everybody says beetroot. No, beetroot. Beetroot. Yeah. He's got a T. Yeah. Oh, thank God for that. It's so, not a silent T, is it? Everybody else seems to think it is. Oh, 
Look at it in here. This is the shop. Ah, this is like after open all hours, isn't it? Not after open all hours, just open all hours. Open all hours. Look at it. This is so good. It's got the old weighing scales over there and everything. Are you all right? Could you make much more noise, do you think? <coughs> I could. Definitely going to get people telling us off now. No masks. It's always because of you as well. Mr. Coffee. John Coffee. Who's John Coffee? Green Mile. Oh, I have actually watched that film, but I don't remember that that name. Is it big? Big he's, guy. He's dead. Oh, he is. But anyway, let's have a look what we've got on here. What are all these things here? Look, oh God, there's so much stuff on the floor. The naughtiest girl in school, Enid Blyton. But look at these little things of tablets. And I don't know what that is. It looks like chloroform. Oh, they tablets go weird. weird. Oh, they've got some in them now. They've got like cotton, cotton wool. wool. They always put cotton wool in top of tablets. Why? For whatever reason, I don't know. That's weird. Remember, my mum having tablets with cotton wool in. Look at, look at this. Alberto gel set. Super hold hairspray. I bet you used to use that, didn't you? Only for my pubes. No, your hair were massive back in the day. I used to use gel. Oh, did you? Yeah. Were it wet look? Yeah. I used to use wet look gel. You can't you use that. It, I used to have a mullet. I used to love my it's mullet. It's so strange that you used to have big, black, thick hair, and now you've got nothing. Nothing. Sign if you could have your hair it. back, though, would you? No. I feel like we've had this conversation no. before. I like so. as I am because it's low maintenance. Well, yeah, no, but I don't know. A lot of people like the the bald man look, don't yeah. they? There's so. man bod and everything like that. They don't like six packs no more. Either. That's a load of rubbish. Of course they do. That's just that's just middle aged men making up a no a little dialogue about it. Load of rubbish. You tell people enough they like something, they're gonna like it. What's to do? But it's that's not true. Like me. It's not true. I ain't got a six pack. Everybody loves me. Yeah. Yeah, and Lee Lewis is a cunt. What? Oh, Jerry. <laughs> help, um, help me. No. No, I can't be bothered. Oh, that's good. Shift. Let's have a handshake. Let me get over there. That's really good. Look at that. That Circus Savings Bank thing. That's really, really good. There's loads of little bits of stuff, like weird gnomes. But this, I bet there's loads of good stuff on the floor. Really? I just, I, I hate standing on things like this because you just don't know what good stuff you're standing on. It's such a shame. What you found? Oh. Is it real? No, it's no, not real. I thought it were at first. Well, if you actually, I, I, you know, like when I'm trying to look at something, you move it to one side and then you throw it away. Look. Yeah, look at it's it. It's good. You're an idiot. You're an absolute idiot. Oh, this is so good. I love it in here. Oh, look at that little... What's this box for? Is it snuff? Is it, tiny is it snuff or is it like tablets here? It's in my hand. What's that? I don't know, because two compartments. I feel like it's snuff or is it earrings? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what that is. Oh, it's got plastic in it though. Uh, but... Well, for a start, nobody calls them air buds. What I the, do. What, it, the hell you is, it. what the hell is an air bud? You are such a boomer. There you go. Look. look at that. That's good. That's the sort of thing I would have wanted when I were at school. I just love it. Just wonder what were on all these shelves. Road to Rakaposhi. What do you reckon were on these shelves? Absolutely anything and everything. Would it have, what sort of shop would you say this is though? It sells absolutely everything and anything. No, it can't be though. I like, think so. I think it sells food, it sells DIY, the little village, it sells everything. Oh, I suppose so. That does so. Wallpaper, because it's great up there, look. Kleenex. Oh yeah, wallpaper from Kleenex. Why is there a like a an organ? Organ. <clears throat> I think of the word then. Oh, are they collector card things down there? Cigarette cards. Yeah. Well they're not always cigarettes, sometimes they're tea, aren't they? What's that say? Tip. Oh no, it's had a game in it. Mm -hmm. Looks like Oliver. What saying? Yeah. You know, like a. Oh no, because there's nothing written on the back of it. So that sort of doesn't make sense either. What would have this. Oh, is that bit there to hold things that are longer? Like that? Like light bulbs? 
Yeah. That's why they've put it up at top up there. Oh, there's just, I feel like there's just so much stuff in here and I, I can't take it all in. It's so good. Oh, look at this. I need this. The Sainsbury's Book of Slimming. I like that. Actually, I've had quite a lot of nice comments about our oh, weight. Yeah, yeah, I have. Although I have put about five pounds back on in the last week. So, but we're well, going to put in more on next week when you're away. Actually, I'm not because I've been doing a lot more exercise. Although I generally put a stone on when I'm away. Look at these, all these horse books, all about riding and caring for horses. There's loads horses. of them. Messiah. Oh, Leah and Rachel would love these. Instant cookery books. Are they like about my? Is it like original old microwave books or something? It says, stop me and buy one. Look at ice cream, High Street USA, honey is magic, Barbara Cartland. Let's make an omelette. Health food facts and fads. What, what, what? What's Barbara Cartland gonna do with anything? Dunno. Don't she was like romantic novelist, weren't exactly. she? Exactly. Yeah, because you know, in the village up, or a couple of villages up from where I'm from in Scotland, there is a shop or a restaurant it's really weird. It's all pink inside. Yeah. And a woman used to dress up like Barbara Cartland that lived there. She looked just like her. Well, why not? But then she died and nobody knew she'd died. And her son wore the same clothes. She didn't stab her in the shower. No, <laughs> it's very much, that's what it reminds me of. psycho. Yeah, it, it, Helmsdale. It's a place called Helmsdale. And I can't remember the, oh, La Mirage. I think the name of the, the restaurant, oh, the restaurant is. Yeah. The name of the place. No, but loads of people didn't realise. Oh, your missus wants them. Yeah, they're messaging me. Look at the envelopes. <laughs> yeah, tell her where they are. Can't find them. And there's some there. Some here. Here you go. <laughs> some here. <laughs> some here. Oh, dear. What is, what is this book about? Right, look at this. Look at this one. Look at the front cover. What? What's that? Isn't that like Frank Carson or something? <laughs> With, with a knife. With a knife and some stuff going through his Psychotic head. Psychotic weighing scales. What is that all about? Look, it says Barbara Cartland on that one as well. That one's got a... Yeah, Barbara Cartland. I wonder if she had a... Like a section in it. Yeah, there a look. Oh, yeah, that's good that you opened it straight there. Yeah. Oh, that's a bit mad, isn't it? What a date on this? They've got to be 80s, 70s, 80s. Oh, there, top corner. Oh, 1971. 1971. Bleeding heck. Firework pizza. That sounds good. Yeah. Oh, I bet there's some right recipes in there. Oh, savoury pancakes with sick on. Looks disgusting. I hate savoury pancakes. Savoury pancakes are just ridiculous. What do you mean that's not sick? Are you saying that's something bodily fluidy? That is definitely. That is wrong. Say that. I don't know if it is or not. Been a while. What about that underneath? What is that? Sort of. That looks good. Don't know what it is, but I like it. That's really good. I don't like the look of those things, though. I just feel like I'm focused on these far too much. Let's have a look. What else have we got on here? Oh, look, they had all things like this as well. Like weird bits of mat material. What? What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, yeah. Hair ornaments. But, yeah, you're right. You are right about having, like, a bit of everything in here. Like, they're just bits of material and then... You've got ice cream mix. Is that even a thing? Family family brick size? <laughs> what? Vanilla flavour. I've just... got a quarter pint of milk and whisk once. What, once? <laughs> and it's done. <laughs> oh. I don't think that's worth it. I think that's a... Look, this is oh. what I'm making my way over to. Look at this. Old weighing scales and the old till as well. I've definitely opened all hours till that, innit? 22... Oh, two and a half. Is it 22 pound and two pence and a half? God, no. 22 shillings and two and a half pence. Would it be? I've got no idea. That's really strange. Well, 22 shillings will be five, or one pound ten. I, I, I don't know. You're talking to the wrong person. I'm no good with normal money, let alone... I'm sure a shilling used to be 5p. No, weren't that? Oh, no, 50p is 10 bob. 10 bob. But that, doesn't that mean that 5p's a bob? Bob? Yeah, and what do you say? Shilling? Shilling. Yeah, I don't know. 
I yeah, Bob. Ten Bob. Shilling. <laughs> I feel like you're just saying words now. I've got no idea. <laughs> I'm sure people will tell us in the comments. Oh, all, look at it. Got another organ now. Oh, yeah. Is that the old ice? Is this for ice cream? Yeah. Oh, look at it. It's like it's got a little glass front and everything. Frozen food. This is proper good retro. Ooh. I love it in here. I absolutely love it. What's that say? Stoke margarine. Why would you have Stoke margarine in that glass cabinet, you think? Runny and horrible. Oh, look, it's your mate. Diana. Oh, bless her. Ah. What's, what's this? Turn this upside down. Oh, there's an half pea there. See it? And yeah, a little old half pence. What what's the blue about? thing? Everywhere, warmth, SO blue. Would that have been gas bottles or something? Could be. It just, it's like proper a 60s, 70s. Look at it. You can just imagine 60s, 70s shops just being full of things like this. Look at the doll, look at the doll, look at the doll. Little plastic freaky doll. That's so good. I'm so overexcited about all these things in here. Aniseed alcohol cordial. I thought you said you couldn't have cordial that was alcoholic. Don't know. Clearly you can. What are you throwing? Oh, the envelopes. Yeah. Oh, start margarine on there as well. Was there anything in this cabinet? I didn't actually have a look. No. Oh, look at the little pony thing. I remember them. My little pony. Oh, it's no, it's galloping pony. pull along pony with tinkling bell. <laughs> You've got to love a tinkling bell. You really well do. What's in here? Oh, fell down there. What's in here? Oh, not, not much. All oh, these great good display cabinets. I proper love it. I really do. Oh, look, what's this? Oh. Really old purse. Oh, yeah. Kids purse. Master Cut English Hunting Clothing. What's this book? Is it another one of those horse? Oh, no, it's Horse and Hound from 1988. We've been in Horse and Hound. Did you know that? Yeah. Oh, I don't think you knew that. You even sell shoes, look. Yeah, I know. If you looked over here, behind you... Wait a minute, I'll try to step on the dog's head. Oh, God, yeah. Yeah, look. You've got all the shoes, and I bet they took shoes in to be fixed and stuff in Colors. here as well, yeah. So either sent them off or did it themselves. What's this? It's like a weird... Oh, you oh, you ring it up. It's got numbers on that side. It's like a... Sort of like a till, but not a till. Yeah. It's to, like, make receipts, isn't it? Oh, there's all shoes in there as well. Is there? And flip-flops and things. Let's have a look. Oh, yeah. This is so good. I proper love it. And we've saved the last bit of it, the best bit, to last, haven't we? Tom, on beer. Oh, loads of people used to do that. Used to be a fad, were not it? Beer and wine. Yeah. Oh, look at that till there. I wonder when that's from, originally. Like, 20s, 30s. <laughs> I have no idea. It's got, it's it, got to be. It's it? got to be old, yeah, definitely. Oh, it's so hard to walk anywhere. I don't want to break anything. But it's just, it's starting to, everything's going, look. The damp's got in. Look at the old toy guns and the little thing that you catch the ball in. Oh, you flick it up? Yeah, you flick it up and it catches it in that sort of. That's what I try to do. Basketball net thing. What are you on about? Flick the ball up so you can get it in. Oh, you just. Balls deep. Are you disgusting? Absolutely. What are you doing? Yeah, look. This, I reckon this. Oh. Is this. Would that be for someone to come and pick up? Dry cleaning. Yeah. And they never came. Never came. Why is Bear in the cupboard? Come on, get out of the closet. What? <laughs> you can't say that. What are you doing in there, Bear? Covered in cobwebs. Look at state of your head. You're absolutely covered, aren't you? Absolutely covered. Look at them bobbies. Oh, they're horrendous. 80p. Brand new. Well, only for one, for a one-legged person. Are they um, slippers? Yeah. Oh, let me look at the box they came out of. Oh, Spongy slippers. Oh, that's right. Made by Pirelli. Yeah, well, that's As in that. the tyres. I didn't know tyres made shoes. I mean, no. Pirelli made shoes. Right, look at the size of those. They're size one, right? Remember they're those shoes from stairs? Definitely. They're bigger. They're not bigger. Look, Look at the style of them. They're all brand new, aren't they? Yeah. That's crazy. 
Absolutely mental, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, look at this is that thing, look, I was looking at. It's to make receipts, isn't it? Definitely. And that's its only purpose. You just put in how much it is and it prints it out there. It's weird to think. What's that? Oh, are they pants? <laughs> they are awful. What's the hook inside for? Oh, my Lord. What? God knows where Bear's going now. Yeah. Um... It's weird to think that there was a machine for receipts and then the machine for the till as well. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. It wasn't all integrated. For, um, like, accounts and stuff. Yeah. Weird. Oh, look at that there. How cute is that little thing? Oh, that's good. Apart from the weird bug on it. That is good. Right, I want to get a bit further around the back of here. There's some weird... Oh, they're Dunlop trainers. Dunlop trainers from the 70s. I bet they're worth a few quid, you know. You I, I don't like Dunlop. I've never liked Dunlop. I know a lot of people that do like Dunlop Green Flash or whatever it I, is. I used to love Dunlop Green Flash. Yeah, loads of people did. But it's before my time, I think. That's what it is. But look at this. Take apart animals from... Looks like from China or Japan. They're good. Didn't really get much stuff from places like China and Japan in the 70s, did you? No, not really. We're all British made then, weren't we? Yeah, exactly. Oh, I thought that were a Levi's jacket then. Oh, look. Just a minute, one sec. Oh, I thought it was Levi's. Oh, the thing is, people... I remember people made fun of me and called me T-Bar because I used to wear some shoes that had got, like, a buckle on them and they fastened across. And it, Do you know what I mean? With, like, a, a T across the top yeah. of it. That's what I used to wear, and I was only about probably five, but people called me t -bot. Stop picking bras up and knickers up and stuff. You're just disgusting, man. Right. Oh. How come there's only one of each? I don't know. Maybe it's display. I've seen the lion thing. What's the lion for? Almost reminds me of the World Cup from 1966. What's it say on the back, or is it just... Oh, is it a, is it a money box? Oh no. Oh no, it's like a push along toy. Oh, there you go. Got a pair there, look. Nice oh. pair. Nice. Right, I'm coming behind there. Right, behind here, you can see inside the cabinets now. Look, with all the different shoes and stuff. And the, oh, the little red. Do you get little red plastic straws like that anymore? You don't get plastic straws very often anyway, but. No. You know the no, little. Are they called Calippo cups? Calippo, yeah. What? Calippo. Calippo? Yeah. Not, not Calippo. What the Calipo. fuck is a Calippo? Calippo? Calippo. Calippo. Yeah. You put them in, but I never used to. I used to bite the bottom of them. Through the top. Yeah, but you bite the bottom and suck it through the bottom. Well, you do. No, if you're cool, that's what you do. If you're like an old fanny, then you stick straw in it. Definitely. Anybody that used to bite the bottom and, and drink it through the bottom of the thing. We're just a heathen. A, no, you're a legend. Absolute legend. No, oh, you're weird. Oh, look. Three baby pants. There's all sorts of weird stuff behind you, to be no, fair. So absolutely everything in here. Yeah. No, you're right. I am I am saying, oh, muscles. I love muscles, but those muscles are not nice muscles. I wonder when they... Oh! Label came straight off it when I picked it up. I wonder when they're from. Van Smitten Muscles in vinegar. Oh, there's a fireplace behind there. I've seen it. Seen my, it? my dad used to be a cockle and muscle man. What, yeah. his grand pub? Yeah. Like when he were really young, though. Don't see that anymore, do you? No. Nope. All down to bloody health and safety and hygiene and food safety and everything. Well, yeah, because you don't know where they're coming from. But I don't know how long they've been out at the fridge. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, these old drawers are good that down here. I reckon there's loads of different eras worth of furniture in here, you know. From like, like early nineteen hundreds through the twenties, through the forties and fifties. So good. So so good. I love every last bit of it. I don't know what that is that oh it's a fire, I think. I love it. Proper, proper love it. Right, I've had to squeeze in here to get a little view of that fireplace. Oh, there's cupboards and stuff around there as well. You just can't get to them because stuff's shoved in front of it. But 
yeah, another little, it's definitely at least Victorian this place. Looking at some of these fireplaces, I would definitely say it's at least late 1800s, but I think it's earlier than that. I think it could be. I think maybe as far back as late 1700s or something, looking at no, it. I'll, I'll no, I do. I don't think it's that early. I do. I, I think that stuff's been added to it and changed over the years. I think Caesar used to live here. Caesar? Wait, that's new. Look at that beam that's just been put there. One there. A little one there. Yeah, but it doesn't sort of fit, does it? Yeah, there's a big, um, whatever you call them, CJK or whatever it RSJ. is. RSJ. RSJ. <laughs> I don't know. CJK, CNA, BMW. JFK. JFK. Oh. M&M's. I love it. I love it. Oh, and that's the display in the window as well. That's where they would have displayed everything for you walking around outside. We need to look at the outside of this building. Yeah. It's very, very rare we show the outside, but I need to have a look today because I'm interested to see how freaky it looks. Because what it looked like when we walked past, it did seem quite spooky. The whole front's fell away as well. Has it? Where's the dog gone again? Can't even hear him. Just look behind there, because I don't see him coming. It's yeah. him this way. Oh. He's over there. Is he? Oh yeah, yeah I could just see his... Go on, Bear. What are you doing? Bear boy? What are you hiding under there for? Bear. Stuck again, eh? No. Come on. Come on. You're being weird tonight, dog. He's going from being hyper. <coughs> oh, here we go again. <coughs> Dust. Yeah, he's really dusty in here. Um, he's gone from being hyper to then sitting and not doing anything to being hyper and then sitting and not doing anything again. Yeah. So hard to stand up in here, isn't it? It's like rolled up carpets and all sorts. But yeah, look, it's just sat under there. Like an absolute weirdo. Come on, bear, we're going. You're coming. No, not bothered. He's not even trying to move. Right, if we walk away, he's probably gonna follow us anyway. Oh, I just love it in here. I know as well, I've missed so much stuff. I bet there's loads and loads of stuff behind here. Like on these, on these shelves. Like dot to dot books. Like I said, when do you see things like dot to dot books these days? Oh, yeah, no. I got that. Which hand? The one with the torch, you know, the one that I'm filming with? Ready? No, because I know what it is. Do, I can see him on there. Get the fuck away from me with buttons, you tramp. You're an absolute disgrace. Get the, get them put away. You're a disgrace of a man. You're horrible. Oh, what is, what is this? What is this thing? Is it a typewriter? Oh, oh no, it's a number thing. It's a number cruncher. Yeah, but it is, but look at it. It's like, oh, what do they call that? There's a machine that's supposed to solve everything. Oh, that tin a computer. No, but look at this tin. Look at this tin, this tin, this tin. Tin, tin, tin. Tin, come and look at this. Come and look at this tin. Wipe the tin down. That's the queen. That's the little baby queen. You want to wipe the queen down? Yeah, no, but look at her. I don't think you can. It's like rust, isn't it? But look, can you see it? Turn it around. Is it a dad on the front? It is. Is it a mum on the back? Yeah. Oh, no, I don't know who that is. That is. Oh, oh, look how lovely she looks on that with that crown. But yeah, is that, is that, um, Mary, not Mary, what's she from called? Sister. Queen's sister. It's not Anne. It's Margaret. Margaret? Princess Margaret. Shut up, because that's my mother. Margaret! Margaret! To be fair, you are in the right place for it. I will yeah. let you off on this occasion. But... Reliable brushwork. Oh, yeah, oh, it's those things. Again, yeah. yeah. Oh, there's all sorts. Look, little thimbles on here as well. I don't know what this is. Oh, these old prices? Aladdin heaters and spare parts. Chimneys. Is that a chimney? Yeah. Goddard. No, oh, I can't even read. Oh, cedar mops and polishers. Paste powder. Yeah, I think it's like an inventory, isn't it? Inventory? Is there anything else good down there? Inventory. Inventory. It's not an inventory. We're not American. It's, it's. Oh, you dirty little man. You. Got some aluminum. 
Oh, don't shut up, aluminum. Don't start with that, balls. It's aluminium, and you know it is. What we got? Are they all like ant powder? Ant powder? What are these things under here? Shoes? Are they birthday cards? Oh, no. <gasps> oh, the children's books. Oh, the story books. Look. These are good. Why is Bear still sat under there? He hasn't shifted. He's freaking me out a bit. Oh, is he coming now? Bear? Bear? He's not even moving. You know when you put stuff in brown paper bags? Oh, yeah. Although it's going back to that now, isn't it? You get paper bags more than plastic yeah. ones these days. But yeah, look at all the storybooks under there. Fairy tales, tales and fables, is it? Yeah. Puss in Boots. Oh, it's so, so good. Um, I love it. I love it in here. It sort of almost reminded me of my childhood, but you like, you know, like, you go in like these old fashioned shops now. So you go in a shop and they'll be, still be selling stuff from like the 80s and 90s. Yeah. When I was little, the shops then were selling things from the 70s and 60s that were sort of out of fashion and not nobody really wanted them. There's a shop in the next village up from my village that I, you know, in Scotland, yeah. that has never been open. In your village. It is my village. Oh, God, don't start, because this is what Rachel says. You don't own the village. I don't own the village, but it's still my village. That's no, where you're from. Right, okay. So well, is, is England your country? No, it doesn't belong to me. So it belongs to all of us. It doesn't. But like Scotland's my country, um, and it's my village. But yeah, anyway, there's a shop that's had the same clothes in the window since I was about five, and it's never been open, not once. So I feel like the I'm. The shop's never been open. Ne I've never seen it open. I've been going up there forty-three years. It's just full of skirts. Yeah, yeah. I it would be. Weird. Oh, talking about weird. That's freaky. That's the boyfriend of that armless girl. Or the, yeah. Uh, arm, armless does its eyes open when you lift <coughs> it up? <sighs> oh, it does. Look, watch. Lou, Lou, let it go down slowly because I can't let go because it's just going to drop. That's it. Look. Goes to sleep. Oh, that is freaky. And it's a little brown outfit and one shoe. It's club foot. <laughs> What's that book thing on top? This. The elephant thing. Oh, is it to make an elephant? Cuddly books. Oh, it's a cuddly book. It's a book that's cuddly. It's an elephant book. Oh, look at that. Things were so bright and colourful back then as well, weren't they? Right. It's so it's good. I'm so overexcited about everything. I love it. I want to say we don't. Oh, this is that thing that I'll run about. Look. This is like for big maths. This is more than just your two plus two. Look how many numbers there are on there. Why do you need so many nines? So many eights? No idea. Oh, is he finally coming? Yeah, but which way? We don't know. <laughs> yeah, what's that machine that where they solve all the Morse code? Do you know what I'm on about? Yes. Oh, I can't remember what it's called though. Do they make a film out of it? I don't know. Enigma. Enigma. Enig Enig yeah. Enigma machine. Yeah, that's what that is. It's the Enigma machine. Oh, you're on the rest now. Yeah, you decided, a <laughs> decided you're coming to talk to us for a bit. You ain't some social bastard. Oh, God. Oh, is this the storeroom, do you reckon? Look at this big mirror. That's that got a fireplace, doesn't it? Yeah, it's huge. Absolutely huge. Oh, there's all sorts in here, Andy. Oh, there's old lamp fittings as well. I can't actually move. Just trying to see, I don't want to miss anything before I set off walking. What are they? What is this? What are they? What is that? Oh, I should probably look at the thing that it says on it. Oh, cellulose tape. Cellulose tape. Is that what it is? Is yeah. that what cellulose tape is? Yeah. Cellulose tape. Cellulose tape. Oh. Well, that's weird. I've never heard it called cellulose tape before. There's just so many good things. And like you said, you were right about I'm selling everything because there's literally everything. What is this? Subtle flattery. 
tights by Lucky Charm. Don't they make cereal? Lucky Charms, yeah. Yeah. It definitely doesn't look like Lucky Charms on here. It looks like chair with a wig on. What is that? Oh, is it a clock? Alarm light clock weighing Jeez, scales. Mate. Oh, is it? No goblin teas made. What do they do? Make tea. Yeah, but why have they got a clock on them and a light? Because it used to, um, if you set like an alarm, it starts to warm your, your kettle up thing on there for your hot water. But you needed an alarm for it? And yeah. then you needed a flashing light on top? Yeah. What's that all about? Well, you look, the light used to just be for just turning your light on. Surely that's got to have been made by an American. Probably. Because they don't have kettles, do they? Oh, we, people keep telling us off for this, saying that they do have kettles, but they don't have kettles. Not like we have kettles, do they? No. They have ones that you boil on stuff. Yeah, they don't have electric kettles. Yeah. They put them on, like, stoves. Yeah, exactly. And do you know that we are the, one of the only people to have what they call freezing, freezing scold taps? Because we have hot and cold taps rather yeah. than one that's joined together, or faucets, whatever they want to bloody call them. Farrows. Farrows? Father faucet majors. You're a weirdo. I know that's a person. Faucet. I don't know. Right. Oh, look at all the stuff on the floor. There's just so much. I just, I just want to pick it all up. Although my shorts falling down, so I had to pick them up first. Oh my lord! Can we even get through here? Is it even possible to get through here? We'll squeeze through if you don't fall on us. Oh, let's have a try. Oh lord! This is awkward, and there's bits of ceiling everywhere. There's bits of. Oh god! It's just held up by twigs. This this roof, Andy. Ow! Watch out, because it's. A bit awkward to... Oh, I'm getting stuck on everything. This has really got stuck here. Oh, is it? Is this where he was? It was here. Oh, oh right. It was here. So he's got it stuck on here some, somehow. Oh, right. He must have been trying to get out of that door. You might have to lift him up. Oh, this goes outside, Andy. Through here. Oh, God, it's like a... It's like a jungle. Ooh. Ah, ah, I got it stuck to my ear. Oh, look, oh, these are the things you used to make beer and wine in. What are they called, these things? Watch out, because it's spiky as old, that. What are they called now? Cider bottles. No, they're not cider, they make wine and beer and stuff. Damn. That's a... An old fridge. Oh, have you seen the car? There's a car here. It looks like a Citroen from side. Have a look. It is, it's Citroen. Yeah. Look at me. Look at me recognising a car. Yeah, it's got a little sound yeah, in there. It's XUT 847Y. Old wire edge. Don't know. Well, it's mine on my hydraulic um, suspension, which is bounced up and down. Is it? It must be brilliant then. Oh, there's all... You set it up, put it on that ice satin. Yeah. And then go over bumps. Oh, God, it was amazing. <laughs> <laughs> like that. You got a car full. I wonder what's behind there, but there's sheds and all sorts, but it's just like a jungle. Absolutely no way of getting through. Mm, Rip your face off. Let's see what's... Um... Mate, look at this building. Don't you think that this is... You know who's saying it's a lean-to? I think it's original. It just... They've put like plastic roofs on it up there that's collapsed. But the brickwork and everything is original, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, look. This is brilliant. I like this building a lot. It's big. It's bigger from the outside than I realised it was, to be honest. And this is the old store front here then, isn't it? This is the shop front, look. Oh, look at the Walker's Crisps thing. I didn't see that when we were inside. Look through there. There's the big Walker's Crisps. That's something else Rachel makes fun of me for. What? Crisps. Crisps. Yeah, she says that I say ps at the end. Crisps. Crisp. She says it should be just crisp, not crisps. Oh, it's crisps. 
Yeah, but she says it because should it's be... Because more than one. You get, you get more than one crisp. It's one crisp. Yeah. Crisps. She says, oh, yeah, you get a bag of crisp. <laughs> Manchester, innit? It's not... It's just how it is. Right. Well, look. Look at it. So we've been all the way across this side into the other side as well, and I don't think I can get through down here because it's all barriered off. Can I? Oh, I can. I can, I think. Oh no, it's a bit, it's too tight. But anyway, how freaky is this? I'll go around the front of the barriers and try and show you. Right, so we've just noticed, without showing you the actual thing, there's planning application there. What did he say it was for? Uh, dem demolish it all and put some two-storey dwellings. What a shame though, because there's some right history in this, these buildings, isn't there? Just think, like, yeah. it's serviced this village for probably a couple hundred years, or 150 years or something like that. Easy, easy. You know what I mean? And it's, it's the people have been in and out through these doors over the years, and now it's just going to be knocked down. And I know, it, don't get me wrong, oh, I can stand on here and show you. Look at that. How good is that? That is, don't get me wrong, it is dangerous inside. But I think that's saveable. Don't you? I don't know. No, if you ripped out, you've got to remember that lap back bit's like a lean to. So the bits that are collapsing, you just rip those out. Everything else, it's a lovely building. Looks all right from front, but I'm not sure. I, I think it's fine. I think it's sure, you can sure that up. But I'm no builder, am I, so. Anyway, let's. It's probably, uh, it's probably cheaper to demolish it. Well, it will. Lots of things oh, are cheaper. Cheap. That doesn't mean it should be done. No. Right, come on. Right. What do you think about that? I like, weren't it? I really liked that. It's probably one of my favourite explorers we've done for a while. Is it? Really is. Two things. One, that shop. That shop was just so good. Yeah. There's so many little things. Even like the rooms with hardly anything in. They got some stuff like the picture of Winston Churchill, Churchill. and things like that. I just really liked it. But do you know what? The thing I like about that place the most. There's a room upstairs. Is that room? I want to go back now. Get stuffed. I'm not going back because it's one o'clock in the morning. We've got a three and a half hour drive. But I just feel happy there. I don't feel happy anywhere else. I mean, it's be too pleased to say that. <laughs> yeah. No. <laughs> Sorry. But no, it, I don't know. There's just something that kept drawing me to that room. I went very hopeful when I pulled up. I'm not going to lie. I was. I looked at it and thought, this is a creepy, freaky house. And we haven't been to a creepy, freaky house for a long time. And there was something about it that was good. Well, I knew it was going to be a shop. Yeah, you knew that. I didn't know that's, that. That's all, that's all I knew. Do you know why you didn't tell me? It's because I go, oh, fucking shop. Fucking shop. Oh, I don't want to go to a shop. Especially not, hotel. not three hours, 20 minutes away for a this shop. A shop. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So, I didn't know. And I'm glad I didn't know uh. because... I walked in and I was like, wow, this is good. I love this building. I'm glad you enjoyed that one. Yeah, I did. I'm glad it was worth the three hours and 20 minutes. <laughs> so we are going to get off home because it's a long, long drive. and I've It's two hours sleep by the time I get in. I'm going to have a nice lane in the morning. Well, I might have three hours. Anyway, get subscribed to us so we can go full time, please. Because then you don't have to have two hours sleep and you might stay yeah, if alive. Yeah, you all become Patreons, every single one of you become a Patreon, a pound, a pound of thing. Yeah, that's it. Just one, like what, we get... Maybe in a week, first week, fifteen to 20,000 um, views. If every person out of that put a pound in, we could fucking retire. <laughs> yeah. Retire by Christmas. Yeah. Anyway. 50 pence. Well, it's minimum a pound. Yeah, it's minimum of a dollar. A dollar. It's just like 80 pence or something. Yeah, you tight bastards. No, don't be like that. People support us by viewing, viewing the videos. That is all I'm bothered about because that's what pays my wage. But I'm sorry. I just love that you watch us and I really appreciate you and you. Anyway, and on that, we're going. We'll see you later. I love you. Love you. Love you. You're horrible. Why are you being horrible when I'm saying I love you? Love you all. Bye. Get your tits out. <gasps> no, you can't say that. Well, I'll pay you a pound. <laughs> You're an idiot. Let <laughs> me tip pick and I'll send you a pound. That's disgusting. You can't send them a pound, then we'll be skinned. It's not coming out of your way, it's coming out of mine. All I right. don't care. Fair send enough. me a tip pick and I'll send you the pound. Do what you need to do. Or a pound of tip.
well, depend is it now depending on size as well? Or? Don't care. You really don't care. He's messing me on Facebook. <laughs> <laughs> Stop it. You know what this looks like? This is my page. My face. You're an idiot. Whatever. Bye. And bye. Go on. Just a quick one this week because the video was so long. I just want to say a massive thank you to our Patreon members. And also, if you do want to become a Patreon, it's patreon.com slash finders beepers. Thanks for being amazing.